It's a Friday night in Baltimore and the Red Sox and Orioles tangling game two. The Sox have been waiting nearly four months for slugging first baseman Tristan Casas to come back and he returns tonight here at Camden Yards. Some breaking news just a couple of moments ago. Adley Rutschman scratched from today's lineup. It's lower back discomfort, the word for the Orioles. So James McCann in the lineup. The Orioles ace honored on his bobblehead day, a day in which he'll take the hill. Corbin Burns, bobblehead day. Corbin Burns, start day. Rounded up the middle, trying to make a play. Holiday with a backhand, throwing, not going to get him. And that's going to be a base hit for Duran. Abreu, 271, 14 home runs. He's going to knock that one down the right field line. That's hit over the corner. Here comes Duran. He hits third. He's trying to score. There will be no throw, and the Red Sox lead it one to nothing. William Abreu with a double to right field to plate Duran. First time in a long, long time. Tristan Casas has returned from his rehab. It's a little trickler here. Burns will scoop that and flip onto the bag at first. Down to third goes Abreu. Well, you get this second run on the board, and that's up to Devers now. Raffi 296 with 25 home runs. High in the air in the shallow right field. If it's fair, it's going to get a run home. It is! And Abreu comes home. It's a bloop double for Raffi. And the Red Sox lead it two to nothing. Two and two with one out. Burns holds. He brings it. Long goes down swinging on that aforementioned slider. Yeah. Doesn't get any better than those two. Here's the 3-0. And that is low ball four. So Yoshida draws a walk. The wicked change up the first of the inning. Yeah, well, I'll tell you what, this is, a, you see it, now you don't. This ball runs about six inches out of the inning. Red Sox up 2 0. Against a lefty, Brennan Bernardino, an opener for Boston tonight. And Zach Keller, who sometimes is a back end guy for Boston, is already getting loose. So we'll see how Alex Cora stitches this bullpen game together. Foul tipped into the mid and held on by Wonk for strike three. One away. Pitch number seven here. And it's going to be ball number four. Santander, the first Oriole base runner. Oh, two and down he goes. Guess what got him? A little breaking ball away. Second strikeout for the lefty. And Brennan Bernardino's open is going to close. <laughs> there you go. Faces three batters the minimum. How often is it you can't wait till the starter faces the minimum three? This is going to be a weird night. And Zach Kelly, the first Red Sox reliever. Now Castle lines it out to deep right field. Abreu going back. He's not going to get to this one. But it's a double for Ryan Mountcastle. Santander makes it to third. And the Orioles immediately have the tying run out at second base with two outs in the first. Santander, Mountcastle, the runners. Two on, two out, two, two. And Jimenez elevates it behind the mound near second. And Kelly gets out of the inning. So it doesn't get on much, but he does have power. He does have speed. And he is oh. going to play, apparently, in front of Cooper Criswell next yeah. inning. Rafaela gets a hanging breaking ball. Hooks it to deep left. Kowser gets to it. Well, that's why he's playing left, folks. Number one, it hits. And here's another one. That's going to skip a bit. Deep out there, scooped up by the right fielder, Santander. And he's not going to get him. And it's going to be a hustle double for Jaron Duran. 2-2. Swing and a miss. Ball kicks away from McCann. Got to hurry. Got it in time. Cooper Criswell takes over to pitch the second, and who knows how long after that. Holiday grounds his change up into center field. And that ball banged up the middle hard by Jackson. And it's a slow ground ball to second here, which is booted by Sogard. He is able to get the out at first, but he was certainly in line to get at least the out at second. Ramon was 0 for 3, struck out three times, all on sweepers. Hit on the ground, through the hole, it's short and into left field. Here comes the wave around for Holiday. Throw home by Duran, on a bounce, catch, tag, he's in there. It's an RBI single for Arias, and the Orioles are on the board. It is 2-1. to one. And Roswell slicing the right center. That ball's not caught by Rafaela. And a great read by Ramon. He's going to go all the way to third. Here's Colton Kowser, left-handed hitter, with runners at the corners. Chriswell throws. In play to first base. Casas slings it down to second. Got it out there. Back to first. And in time to turn the double play. And a big double play indeed. Nicely started by that man at first base. Just to get back in the lineup tonight for the first time since the third week of April. He has grounded to the pitcher 0 for 1. 3-1 hammered up the middle for a base hit. It's easy. 
but nice swing on that baby. And Tristan's on for the first time. I'm sure, that feels good to get one under his belt. Technically now three game hitting streak separated by four months. Raffi first time up with a double his previous eight games he was hitting 161. That's a shot driven out to right center field. That's way way back there. That is gone. Raffi with a blast. His 26th. A two run shot. Red Sox open it up four to one. Instead it's out number two. Two down here in the bottom of the third. Ryan Mountcastle. So Mountcastle first pitch on a deep to left field. Apples off the very tippy top of the wall. Hustling into second. Now he's got a 400 foot double. And now Jimenez batting with a runner at second and two out. Jimenez a loop out towards left center. It's down for a base hit. Mountcastle's going to jog home. An RBI double, Eloy Jimenez, and the Orioles have cut the lead in half again, 4-2. And Holiday, the tying run, will swing. And will hit one deep to right. And Brewers at the wall. And this ball's after. And the player takes a tumble. It's a stand-up triple. His first in the big leagues. And it's a one-run game. Three and two for Ramon. Two on, two out. That's a run. It gets past Long. Holiday scores, and the game is tied. What a gift. There's no way in the world that that ball should get by a catcher, big league catcher. It is a walk after all. It took him five pitches to do it. Two walks in the inning, and Burns will face one. And Burns trying to put up a zero. And a chopper through that open hole and through for a base hit. That'll chase in a run. Duran will score. And the Sox are back in front 5 4. This thing feels like it's like the first of 15 is going to win this game. There's a swing and a shot out to right field by Yoshida. Back there, back there. And that ball is out of here. Home run by Massa. A three run bomb. And the Red Sox jumping all over Corbin Burns. This is the first eight run. Number put up against Corbin Burns. A night where eight may not necessarily do it. Both teams have been slugging away. And Jimenez floats this one into left. More elevation from Eloy with a couple of fly ball hits to left. Here's Jackson Holiday. He lines one through the right side for a base hit. But maybe here go the Orioles again against Cooper Criswell. Mullins walks. With nobody out, the tying run is striding to the plate. Here's Urias, the pitch. And he'll hit this one on a line. It's up the middle and into center field. Jimenez scores, but the line keeps moving. Urias with an RBI single to make it 8-5 Boston. They and McCann does have the most grand slams of anybody on the roster in his career with those five. I fly to deep center field. Back Rafaela. He's at the wall. <laughs> Wasn't that far out of the question as it turned out. It will be a sacrifice fly. It advances Mullins to third. So it's a job well done for James. They're down two, and now Bailey Horn pitching for the fourth time in five days. Boy, he did not have much of a shot there. Cows are down swinging. Looked very uncomfortable in that event. He struck him out. 97 to blow away Santander. They get two. It is eight to six. Craig Kimbrell on four days rest. We'll take over in the seventh. So Sogard is on for the first time tonight. He comes with one down and brings up David Hamilton. And a fly ball, well struck right field. That one is back there. It is headed out of here. Hamilton with a home run, a two-run shot. Boy, the Red Sox needed a little bit more breathing room as it turns out. They got it as Hamilton hits number seven. I see Duran here kind of finish this thing off. There's a drive. High deep to right field this one's way way out of here that ball is crushed Red Sox with another home run they're second of the inning to lead it 11 to 6. Kimbrell has been struggling here lately I tell you they're just adding on to some of that pain right Garcia with the Red Sox big 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 struggles 10 runs six and two thirds Mullins that's a fair ball inside the bag headed for right field and Cedric's going to hold on here so now Ramon who had a monster night all against Criswell that's a very capable swing. Deep center field. Urias has left the building. Oh, what a night. We're telling you, this thing is not over. 11 8. Anthony's got his first hit after Colton's first hit. And once again, here comes a tying run. Chopper to the right side. Sogard will work quickly. There will be no turn, however, so. Fielder's choice RBI. Red Sox get three in the seventh. The Orioles get three right back. Henderson gets an RBI and it's 11 9. 
And he will stop there with a stand up double two down. You get a quick one here. A little two out rally. This man coming up in a big night from Massa. 3 2 and a base hit to right field. Here comes Wong rounding. He's going to score easily. Massa just keeps on swinging it. His fourth RBI tonight to make it 12 to 9. As the Orioles continue to try to scratch and claw their way back, and now they face literally a very tall order in yeah. 6 8 Chris Martin. And a hard left side that'll do. Base hit Ryan. And he goes the opposite way to lead off the home eight. There it is. Grounded left side inside the bag. Sneaky, sneaky. Four hit game for Jackson Holiday. So, Ramon. It's been his night. <laughs> Belted to center. Another Ooh. ball really well hit. Rafaela makes the catch. So, sacrifice fly. Career high fifth RBI for Ramon Arias. The Orioles once again answer and make it 12 to 10. McCann goes the other way. A little ducks going to right. It's a base hit. Keep the line moving. Holiday down to third. McCann's got a two hit night. And Colton Kowser will bat as the go ahead run. Kowser, high fly to left. And Duran will make the catch. So two stranded on base and the Sox take the lead into the ninth. Right now they need two to tie it against one of the best closers in baseball history. Kenley Jansen looking for save number 23 of this year. Swing and a miss and a high one. Elevated at 94 to strike him out one down. Swing and a miss to strike him out. Back to back K's by Kenley. And two down in the ninth for Baltimore. And a ground ball to the right side. Sogard will gobble that up. And the Red Sox win it. Crazy game. They'll take it in the win column and they have evened up this series in Baltimore to game of peace.